Hey, people. What's up? What's up? Hey, it's your another... favorite keto home girl. That's right. Joy and Michelle. Back at you. At the park. <laughs> at the park. This is the spot. This is the spot. And you know, I definitely love coming outside, getting in the sun. Yeah. And um, not eating. <laughs> or at least trying not to. Yeah. Yeah. Like for real. Yeah. Yeah. I just had a little cup of coffee with some heavy cream this morning. Mm -hmm. and it was like um, taking a laxative. Basically. That's why I drank <laughs> it this morning. Because yeah. I haven't been fasting. I've been eating, 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 eating. I swear. It's like. Feeling a little out of control. Work. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> But I've felt out of control since we've been fasting, honestly. I really have, really? like, mm. as far as food choices and sugar and sticking to a ketogenic diet, like, this is just, like, you having a deal. the hardest thing for me for some reason. Mm. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't know. I could say a million and one things, give me reasons. But ultimately, I just have to just get some structure and you know do what i don't want to do which is get organized and be serious about it absolutely we have to get tough on ourselves yeah i just can't be a fat kid anymore that's i just right. have to grow up that's right you know yes it, it is growing it is all about growing up um those old habits the boy they want to stick around they want to do keep a hold of you they but do. we have to um we have to say no mm-hmm you know, like I believe, huh, I just have to say no to the cookies and the candy, the cake. I just need to leave it alone, period, you know, and and stop. I feel like it's, it's just been a lot of self-sabotage, mm -hmm. you know. I think we could really be where we want to be right now had we just really given up those things that we love taste-wise and um just go hard with this yeah. you know the exercise like we're out here to exercise today it's perfect weather so we're taking advantage of that mm -hmm. and um and i'm just to the point where i just i want to get to the goal i want to glow up yeah but like i say yes. even earlier today like when we were at the house and i was working on you know blog posts and stuff and it was like as soon as you said you want to come work out i was like oh, <laughs> I mean, I, I, I want to work too. out. Yeah. I want to work out. I want to do it, but it's like I feel like crap because I ate crap last night, and you know, it wasn't I, 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 really, it really wasn't that bad. But we just ate later than we should have. Yeah, and more than we should have. Basically. Yeah, I mean, yeah, and um, not getting very good sleep last night. You know, dealing with our mother. She had you know some issues going on, and then just being frustrated because i feel like okay i know we need to fast and i know we need to not eat but at the same time i want to create recipes and i want to get this book up and popping and I, I you know and then of course being you know a fatty and, and a food lover is like wrapping my brain around like not food can't be my life you know right. like okay they just can't. really going through the emotions of that <coughs> Because it really is just in my brain, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, damn it, it's just food. You can, like, mm -hmm. get yeah. it together. And then everything that's been popping off in the fasting world, the little drama that's been going on, <laughs> you know, with your boy Cole and Mariah Victoria, which I follow both of them. I love both of them. I personally don't think that that yo-yo uh, video that he made was about her. Because when I watched it, I was like, dude was talking directly to me. Like, well, I, I thought he had watched our channel, shit. <laughs> I, I, I would say most of us are going through the yo-yo. Hell yeah. Every you know what I'm saying? person I watch. Because <laughs> most of us are I brand watch. new to fasting. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you're having to relearn, and, right, you know what I'm saying, right. and, and, and lose old ways. Uh -huh. and, and so, yeah, naturally you go up and down. There's, who's mm. going to do it perfectly? You know, uh, so I think he's talking to the masses. Yeah, <laughs> for oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, you know, it, I, I mean, mean, even when he talks about people without purpose and and uh, you know, basically being a slacker, I'm like, yeah, because that's me. I'm unorganized. I don't have responsibility. That's the main reason I don't have children. Cause I don't want to work hard. I don't want to take care of another person. Like I don't. I I, yeah. I like watching TV and kicking it. You know, like my whole marriage was partying. Like, you know, we were basically, we were married, mm -hmm. but we, we still dated. We used to go right. out. 
shit, three times a day, go to the bar, stay up all night. You mm -hmm. know, when we had the party house, like, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. that was my life. It wasn't, oh, we want to, you know, build something. Like, nah, we just pff, having a good time. Yeah, living it day by yeah, day. Yeah, man. I miss them days. <laughs> 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 to be honest with you, like, I, I. But yeah. now you have to be tougher on yourself and I do say no I have to say no because my body cannot sustain that type of living you know no. the only reason why I got it together was because I was getting sick you know and yeah I do want to look good but that does not motivate me or keep me motivated like feeling sick does like today I don't feel good I don't yeah. so that's what's pushing me to get up and get back on track and you know not be a damn diabetic and fatty <laughs> because I don't want to be like my mom you know I don't want to be sick like her so that's what mm -hmm. is motivating me that's uh, what got me up yeah. at 33 you know 300 damn pounds what's gotten that weight off of me is because I felt sick period so yeah, yeah. you know but it's, it's right now it's, it's dealing with my true self and you know it's easy to start something new and get all gung ho with it and you're down with it for a few months, but when it starts to get hard and old habits want to creep back in, that's when it's like, okay, <sighs> you know, I'm at that place well, now where I'm having to look, push and like, like just like an alcoholic, uh, you yes. can't get sober but still taking sips yeah. here and there. You yeah, know, you're, you're right. You're right. You just you can't. That's how I'm like looking at it. Mm -hmm. You know, with this whole food thing, yeah. like we can't just keep, you know have a little cake here mm -hmm. and it, like every day we can't have mm -hmm. we can't be doing that yeah. and 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 think we're going to get over this addiction to yeah. sugar so um I'm, yeah that's I, funny though because i used to drink every single day i smoked cigarettes for years and i easily put that down that was nothing but this food but this food sugar is like so <laughs> We yeah, just we just you and right purging it purging today, it. man. But I, it out. I mean, it's it's you know, I think that this is definitely something that I can overcome. Hell you yeah! Know, just like I was taught to be fat, I can taught to be thin yeah and, and, and healthy. And I can, yes, I can develop those habits. And I think really right now we we're honoring the journey. Mm -hmm. You know, we're realizing okay, it is a challenge, and yes, I'm dealing with something. Like mm -hmm. you're dealing with, you're truly going through it. But just know that you know you'll you'll get to the other side mm -hmm. to where mm -hmm. it's not such a struggle. You That's know? the hope. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, we just have to keep doing the things yeah. to get there. Yeah. You know, and ultimately, you know, just like an alcoholic, get you know, someone who's sober from drugs and alcohol for however many years, they every day mm -hmm. they have to uh, not do those things anymore to stay sober. Yeah, and it's a conscious thing. It's a conscious effort. So we just got to stay woke. Stay woke. <laughs> yeah. Stay well, woke. I don't know. We might need to do like, uh, uh, what's his name? Kill a mic and, and sleep. <laughs> <laughs> the church of sleep. Chill out. Okay. Yeah, sleep is so important. And do less. And, you know. Yeah. But, yeah. But in your community. Purpose. <laughs> yeah. You know? Which, yeah, I, I guess I got to get y'all my purpose. <laughs> Seriously, y'all give us some purpose. Damn sure ain't getting married again, so you can squash that. <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna put it out there, YouTube land. Um, I my birthday is in June, and I have a goal. I have this little cute little bikini, and I'm gonna be <laughs> in it on my birthday. So I'm gonna have to work this ass mm -hmm. out. Work out. Mama gonna work it out. Mama gonna work it out. <laughs> Um, get rid of this stomach and I appreciate y'all for saying oh girl you skinny you ain't got no more to lose that's sweet and all but um, I'm not bikini ready okay <laughs> and so my goal is to be in that bikini like I said by my birthday is June 9th and I can do it I can do it just continuing to work out because just doing a little bit every day I'm not talking about working out for hours a day that's not happening but I can do, you know, a 30 minute yoga video, mm -hmm. something that's a little more rigorous and, and, and walking and using those, um, those bands, resistance those bands, resistance yeah. bands is, is, is awesome. And, uh, and, and staying off this sugar <laughs> is going to help. Yeah. So that's my goal. I got February, March, April, May, basically four months 
Oh, that's more than enough. That's more than enough I mean, really to lose his belly. And, and yeah, that's right. It. Stay focused. Like, you know, do work this health like a job. Mm -hmm. Like, it's my job to be healthy. Mm -hmm. I just want to do it. I just want to get there. I want to get to the goal. I want to feel really, really good. And I have energy. Like, I wanted, I really wanted to come out here today mm -hmm. and, and, and use this energy I feel inside of me. Like, I, I'm just, I'm ready. Yeah. I was ready. And I just want to keep it going because I tell you, you let a day and two go by and then it's a week and it's and like, dang. <laughs> I have, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to break that. Yeah. So bad. Yeah. Well, uh, I don't know about being bikini ready because I, I personally don't want to wear no bikini. But yeah, I, by then I hope to not be still struggling with eating sugar and binging. Mm -hmm. That's just really where I want to be at, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and hopefully be, just, you know, working you know, out on the regs. Exactly, just building new habits. Mm -hmm. You know, working out is not going to be an issue. It's just part of what part we of do. Life. Yeah, you know, we're not trying to be fitness models. We're not trying to be. Uh, you know, doing competitions. That's not uh, it. No, 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 no. You know, I, I'm just trying to be uh, less fat <laughs> <laughs> and just toned. I have read tons of books. I I stay watching people. I you know I know I believe in fasting. I believe in a ketogenic, low carb living. Mm -hmm. I believe in it, and yet I'm still struggling. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. I, I am. Yeah, and I don't feel the need that I. I don't want to hide it because it'd be so easy for me to hide and I can do all kinds of shit to myself to make me look leaner and put up fake numbers and mm -hmm. be lying to you guys but what what's the point of that yeah what is the point of that so I can build a, a channel and make money okay I, that will happen eventually yeah so no, we ain't, we ain't. you know but I actually do want to be better be different yeah. be the woman that I know I can be yes Absolutely. I just have to unlearn what I was taught mm -hmm. and, and learn a new way. It's hard on your own to go from, you know, not being structured to, to fitness. You need, you need somebody. We, yeah, we need somebody to, and Cole is a good example of that, yeah. you know, um, and, and, and just, you know, like everybody needs a mentor mm -hmm. really, if you're going to really be great. Yeah. All the, all the great, you know, Folk, well, people doing great things, you know, have mentors. Mm -hmm. You know, that's what it is. Yeah. So. So, uh, yeah. If you're, if you think you'll be a great mentor, let us know. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, in saying that, I am not like a mentor in that way. Like, like Cole said in his video, I'm not mm -hmm. in a place to be able to give people advice or tell you yeah. what to do. You need to do A, B, C, D, because I'm trying to figure it out. Yeah, I'm still on A. Yeah, yeah, I lost 160 pounds, but I done that with multiple different ways. I don't really know what was right or wrong or whatever. Okay, but I will say this though. Okay, like a lot of people talk down about being dogmatic about uh -huh. your diet or choose be, or having it be like a religion but i swear to you when i'm not dogmatic when it ain't my religion i'm everywhere mm -hmm. but when i'm mm -hmm. focused on it and i'm following the rules and i'm dedicated to it as if it is my religion that's when the magic happens mm -hmm. that's when i'm doing what i'm supposed to do i'm losing the weight i'm yeah structured i'm um, yeah you know doing it yeah so it's like i yeah. don't know maybe that's not the way for everyone but for someone like me like it has well to yeah be. i have to respect it even like though religion. fasting incorporating fasting into our lives has, has been awesome mm -hmm. it is kind of opened up options for what yeah. we can eat and we got a little you know <laughs> crazy got you know mm -hmm. thinking oh it's okay you know i eat this piece of cake and i'm just gonna fast it right, off right right no, we, we got to yeah. stop that because then, because yeah. that sugar, yes. I constantly want to taste it, you mm -hmm. know, on a daily. And it's like, no, you have mm -hmm. to be stricter. I have to be stricter. Yeah. And, and even more so because I work with sugar. Mm -hmm. Like I make pastries all the freaking time. And then I feel myself starting to wane, you know, like even yesterday I ate um, a freaking uh, chocolate chewy. And, and I don't even care about that cookie like that, but it was in my face 
and I just I lost that I don't know fight mm -hmm. to say no and um, but like when we first started fasting I ain't had no problem saying no to that stuff because it was like I want this mm -hmm. I want to do it and I'm gonna do it you, you know I was the dedicated laws, the that's right and so yeah when we started opening it up to eating different things it's, you know that are higher in carb it's like you just want that it takes over your brain mm -hmm. sugar I takes think over your brain another reason I'm struggling too is because I have lost a ton of weight like right I'm, I'm, so I'm on the so the treat yourself the <laughs> exactly so it's so like, like well, that's so good well the thing is like that desperation I had to get it off isn't there anymore because I'm not diabetic anymore yeah you know, I'm not so if I feel like well shoot I can have it and I want it and not having that pressure like I said and then the weight's not coming off like it was because I'm not heavy like that anymore. Mm -hmm. So there aren't going to be big numbers mm -hmm. anymore to lose. Like, I truly don't expect to lose more than, like, one or two pounds a week. Yeah. Because I'm getting closer to, you know, being at where I'm supposed to be. I, my ideal body weight, whatever that might be. So, but anyway, that's, that's our chat for today. <laughs> uh, we're going to, you know, do a little workout here in the park. Mm -hmm. uh, I think we're going to do a little jogging intervals maybe jog walk yeah um, definitely got to do some more push-ups mm -hmm. stay on that yeah gotta get squats. these arms strong they feel weak as i don't know what squats with our bands squats with our bands squats. <laughs> so yeah yeah so, anyway. <laughs> Drop down in the comments and let us know what you think about the, some of the stuff we talked about. What you think about that drama? Did you yeah. watch that video? Did you think that Cole was talking or addressing Victoria or Mariah Victoria? Um, I don't. Even when I watched her video with him in it, I still thought he was like pushing her to the side and was talking yeah. to me. Trying to help you. He's trying yeah. to help you. But yeah, I, I don't know. I just try not to take things personally. I just yeah. don't, you know what I'm saying? I mean, unless he calls our name directly, which yeah. I would be honored. I know, right? Mm -hmm, because I don't take it negatively. Nah. Um, no. So, no. So. You're watching my shit. <laughs> That's what I think. You're I want you. Uh, yeah, I mm -hmm. want you to say something. Yeah, yeah, say something to me. So, anyway, guys, <laughs> we're going to work out now and we yeah. will see you later. All right, thanks mm -hmm. for watching. Yeah.